What's up everybody, welcome to another unboxing. This is gonna be for the PS4 Platinum wireless headset. Now, just a little note, I did get these price matched and I had a couple dollars in the system when I got these. I got these from Best Buy. So I'm gonna let you know if I think they're worth that full retail price, which is actually astronomical. With a two year warranty, these will come out to like $200 with tax. They're going for 159 currently and i believe the cheapest price i've seen is 119 if you google it right now and you can also find them for 139 or 137 at walmart right now but i believe they have to be mailed to you so i did walk in the store and pick these up we're going to get straight into an unboxing of these and we're going to see what's going on and i'm gonna let you know of course in another review how we feel about this headset and i will do a comparison to another headset to give you guys a full understanding of this so let's get straight into the unboxing and let's see what we got in this box all right so let's get straight okay so let's get straight into the unboxing let's check out the box let's see what we got on the sides okay compatible with playstation 4 and vr let me see if i can put that in focus a little more booyah okay so we can read the box 7.1 virtual surround sound of course the gold also have 7.1 virtual surround sound i'm gonna have to test those out to see if they're any different so let's see what we have but of course the special feature on this headset is the 3d audio and select ps4 games 3d audio delivers an amazingly rich audio experience with surround sound emanating from all directions including above and below so pretty much 7.1 is all around and 3d is supposed to be a top of you and under you so that's supposed to be the difference it's supposed to add more detail to you know where your enemies are when you're playing multiplayer games okay so let's check out the other side real fast give you guys the full unboxing content platinum wireless headset wireless adapter with 3d audio processing components usb cable two feet what it says on the side 3.3 millimeter audio cable 3.9 feet travel pouch quick start guide safety and support guide so that's what's in the box that's all right here as you can see and of course the back now i believe this cushion could come off we'll see about all of that when we open it though okay so to show you what this inside just a good look okay so let's open this thing and see what we got and i will be saying that um if i'm not satisfied with this versus the goal i will be returning these for a different headset because i'm in the mood or should I say I'm on the market for the perfect headset? Now, how does it open? As you can see, this really is my first time opening this. And the hating ass dude at the store looked like he really like put my box through the ringer, man. Was that necessary, sir? I had to tell a guy in the store where this headset was. He was showing me like some other stuff. So let me just show you how that works. Let's see. Of course, we gotta pull this out. It's just gonna be snuck. I don't wanna do this without tearing it. Like I said, in case I take these back, because I really want a good headset. Even though I know this is gonna be the best sound since it's a new sound. And I know the Astro is actually gonna have that uh, 3D audio sound. And the PS4 Pro doesn't have an optical port for the headset of the Astros. So you would have to end up buying another piece. And I don't like buying pieces. If this is more simple and sounds good, I'll use it. And I'm really struggling to open it. But there you go. Booyah. And that was a journey. Okay. So you guys probably seen a lot of unboxings or seen this before. If you came to my video and it's the first time, thank you. But if you've seen it before and you came, thank you. Because... You know, I did get these like last on the block. I'm not the new kid with the new toy. This is an early birthday present to myself, by the way. Shout out to my boy for hooking me up. All right, so let's get into it. Let's open it. Okay, so this is different from the golds because these open like this. The golds, you just take the little. Now, some people did unbox these and this piece just slides up off. Mine's is a little bit different. It's like a bookcase. So clearly mine opens like a book. And the headphones almost fell right out. Wow. Okay, so they do feel different than the golds. This is what they look like, guys. Just showing y'all. 
they do feel different than the golds actually people were saying these feel cheaper i get why they say they feel cheaper but they feel more built for comfort they feel more like you could wear them longer they feel like if you put them on your head you may not notice them as much as you would the golds because the golds are thicker right here so this area feels like it's like covering you all right so yeah they fold just like the golds let me show you them right next to the golds real quick do a little quick comparison so you guys can see for yourself now this air moth piece does feel the same size quality definitely feels different on these platinums than these golds man i ain't gonna lie i kind of want to keep them already so hopefully that'll be a good thing just showing y'all now when i was saying the band right it's gonna look the same to y'all here but it's not as you can see this feels like it covers your head more than this would just from the feel of my hand when i pick these up i feel like i got something that's bigger in my hands pulls by the way it just sounded crazy so uh yeah so they have an elastic under them i'm gonna have to try them on and see how they feel this is the right side as you can see under as the right and left to let you know the control switch is on the back of the left everything is here now whereas on the golds you know you had everything on different sides as you can see with the goals you gotta turn everything around uh one piece of information i'm gonna give you guys in advance they said that on this headset you could set all your presets from inside of the playstation without connecting it now that must be an update to the playstation because the same thing the goals do now you don't have to plug in the goals to put a preset on them i don't know when that happened but i tried it the other day and I was able to put a preset on the golds without connecting them so that works for both headsets it's not just this headset because some people think it's just the platinums that do that i actually put the last of us preset into slot number two on my golds without connecting them you used to have to connect them through the usb port all right so let's move on to the rest of the box let's see i'm sure there's something under here in traditional sony fashion and i will be right this is must be where my dongle is let's see if there's any tape the dongle the box is a little bit more intricate as you see it has a little slope playstation loves to slope everything make it look like a console <laughs> it's like a mini playstation box okay so let's open it up yeah okay so that's the usb port cable i'm not gonna open that this is the dongle now let's compare the dongle so i'm gonna take this out Let me take it out of the plastic. Oh, I gotta rip the plastic. No problem. No problem. Alright, so this is the dongle. And let's compare it to the original one. Much, wow, much bigger balls than the gold. Wow. Let's put them side by side. Man, there's, there's something different going on here. Wow. So there's a, oh wow, that's a big difference in the dongle right there though. So there you go, that's the dongle for it. I'll put that over here. Man. Oh man. Okay, so let's see what we got. And this is the 3.5 millimeter jack. Of course, this is why I also wanted these two. You can plug in your 3.5 millimeter jack, of course, to use this with your cell phone or if you're outside or if you want to use it on something different, like for the PlayStation. You would need this in the PlayStation adapter, which I actually do. I use my headset for both consoles. All you need is this adapter here and this, and that's how that works. I have a tutorial for that as well. I will link that at the end of the video. If you guys want to check it out, it's pretty old. It's like two years old when I started my channel. But, you know, if you guys want to use one headset, I'll let you know. Now, of course, to catch to the goals, is when you try to use these with the xbox they're not that impressive but since xbox did a couple of updates they do sound good the problem with xbox is most headsets are all in stereo except for the astros i believe which i actually think those are stereo but i'm not sure and last but not least in the box we got the carrying case i'm not even gonna open it y'all seen this already um that's what it is i'm not i'm not gonna bother to open it matter of fact you know what screw it it's an unboxing doll you gotta do it you gotta do it, you gotta do it. Let's just open it, let's do it. Okay. The PlayStation pouch with the logo right there. 
Of course, I don't know why anybody would ever use that for their headphones because that's how you probably would end up breaking them. So overall, that's that. Let me close this back up. I don't like having these things out and about. I don't need nothing from there, so let me close this back up. I got the dongle. That's all that really matters. Why does that word dongle sound gay to? I don't know. Maybe it's just me. I don't know. There's something about that word. since it went that way. At least I thought it would. Maybe like that. I never was good at doing that. <laughs> it back in the box put it to the side in case this thing is coming to stand now of course guys I don't care if I read this or what I will be doing a full review on these and then I will do, be doing some comparisons to see if it's worth the money it's worth an upgrade or it's worth getting at all or is it better to save money and get the golds you know I got all that coming all right so that's that There you go, there you have it. That's an unboxing of the PS4. Let's put that in the middle, make it like some kind of statue. Uh, that's the unboxing of the PS4 Platinum headset. I'm gonna let you guys know how they sound, how comfortable they are, if they're worth upgrading to, what's the difference. Now I believe off top the difference will be 50 ohms versus the gold being 30 ohms. And that would make a difference. But we'll talk about all that in the review. I'm out of here, let me know what you think in the comment section, peace. Do remember, hit the notification bell under my name to get notifications when I go live and make videos. Of course, I got to hit y'all with that before I break out. Later.